In this video, we're going to convert 1.91 moles of Al2SO4-3 to grams. This is aluminum sulfate. So we have our 1.91 moles of aluminum sulfate, and we want to convert that to grams. So when we go from moles to grams, we're going to multiply by the molar mass. So to find the molar mass for Al2SO4-3, we add up the masses from each one of these elements from the periodic table. If you need help with that, there's a link in the description of this video, how to find the molar mass for this aluminum sulfate here. So when we find the molar mass for aluminum sulfate, we get 342.14 grams per mole. So the units are grams per mole for the molar mass. Now, when we multiply, we have moles on the top and the bottom, we're going to be left with grams, and that's what we're looking for. So we end up with 653.49 grams of Al2SO4. Three. And note that the moles, they canceled out. You know you're doing it right when those cancel out and you're left with grams is what we're looking for. So to recap, we took our moles of aluminum sulfate. We multiplied by the molar mass to get grams. If we were given grams and we wanted to get to moles, we'd take our grams. Now we divide by the molar mass and that'll give us moles of this Al2SO4-3. This is Dr. B converting moles of aluminum sulfate to grams. Thanks for watching.